Oh, dude, it's a safe door. That's what I'm talking about right there. Oh, no. Big spider. Get away. Dude, there's a gator right there. Look at that. Ow, it just got hooked in my hand. Magnification next to a prison today. From California to Florida, here we go with some more magna fishing. We are at a brand new area in Florida that we have never been to yet. I'm sorry, I kind of lost my voice a little bit if you guys can hear that. It's not going so good right now. So I'm super excited to get out here with the magnets and see what cool stuff we can find. I'm gonna go ahead, unpack the magnets and go to the bridge and see if we can't find anything. Well, I see a shopping cart. I see two shopping carts. We're just kind of scouting right now. I don't think this one's gonna work out though. That mud is gonna make it like impossible. See lots of crabs. Is that a piece of a motorcycle maybe? There's a freaking motorcycle frame, but it is engulfed in the mud. Look at the shopping carts. That's what I'm talking about with how much mud there is here. I see a bike too. I see another bike right there. You can just see the pedal sticking out. There's two bikes. We're just gonna try. Wink. Look at that. That is mud city down there. Look how far it was in the mud. All right, we're just gonna throw over here. That might be a full motorcycle frame, actually. There's something right here, too. This entire thing is just full of trash right here. But I don't think we're gonna be able to get it. Dang, I think you got a bike chain. Yeah, a piece of a bike chain. There's so much stuff that is magnetic in that mud right there. I'm gonna get muddy, muddy today. Oh, dude, there's just no way. The suction is too strong. I can't get it, y'all. Making me so mad because there's so much stuff here. Like, I see two bikes, shopping carts. I just can't get it. We're gonna go hop to a new spot. Oh my gosh, this is tiny. This side looks a little bit better. I see a signpost over there. We gotta stay positive. I got something on that throw. What do we got? Yo, what is that? It's like some sort of roller thing, maybe? I don't know. We got something weird. It could be like a something to pull out. I have no idea what that could be. I think that's technically the first find of the day. We're on the board, baby. What are we working with? We got a Whoa, that's weird. We got a big nut. It's like tied down with rope though. It's a Christmas ornament. No, I'm just kidding. I don't know what that is. That is kind of weird though. They're using it to hold something down to the bottom and I want to find it. There's two little gar. There's a mama gar and a baby gar. I definitely felt a click right there. I do got a little something. This is weird looking. Some sort of makeshift bracket it looks like. We shall throw it in my bucket. We got our first big find of the day. Oh dude, it's a safe door. Bro, what is this? Oh my gosh, it is a safe door. Holy cow, that thing's freaking solid, dude. Bro, that thing is so heavy. This is a heavy duty safe right here. It says other key. Dang, man, that is a heavy duty safe door right there. I cannot explain to you how heavy this thing is. This is the most magnetic safe door I've ever found. If you guys saw last video, we pranked Faze Rug. It's closed. Oh my God. Dude, how much money is that? I just got my own <laughs> right there. Dude, this might have someone's address on it. Hold up. I see a name and some numbers under it. Well, Gary, bro, I don't know where you are. I'm sorry you got your safe stolen, but I found the door. <laughs> Imagine how heavy the rest of the safe is going to be. It's probably down there. It feels good to find something. If we're finding safe doors, imagine what else is down here to be found. Is the gun that they robbed the store with down there too? I liked it better when the clouds were out. It's sunny now. <laughs> the sun can go away, it's too hot. I got my second nut. I got a pair of nuts now, man. It's a stick, but I think we got something under the stick. We got a couple things here. What are you? Looks like a piece of a motor. It smells like a piece of a motor too. Oh, it's a big gas cap that's what that is and then we also got this weird looking thing right here no idea what that is but hey good stuff i found that pretty much like right on the bank oh yeah that's definitely a piece of a motor i don't know if you guys can see it but there's some oil going on right there what are we working with it could be a piece of a bed frame yeah that's what i'm gonna go with i'm gonna go with a piece of a bed frame right there this is the world's longest nail oh my gosh look at that thing dude oh look at all that oil now oh yeah it's, it's definitely something right there oh yeah i got a little piece of something coming it looks like it was silver at one point Oh, well, I just completely wiped that off. That's weird. Bro, what is this? Oh my gosh. It's a ginormous pair of brass knuckles. No, it's not. Ooh, is there an accident right there? There might have just been an accident right there. I don't know. Sounded like it. But we got a piece of a pipe right there. Also, if you guys are interested in getting into magnet fishing, go check out battlemagnets.us. Link's down in the description. Oh, we actually got bubbles that time. Oh, shoot. That was the closest I've been to falling ever right there. We have liftoff, baby. This thing's freaking heavy. Oh my gosh. I have no idea what this is. It's like a magnetic cake, bro. Oh, it's a... 
It's a pipe. It's a pipe. It was just so far down in the mud. Then we pulled up the whole thing. We got a little rock. Another little rock. <laughs> it's a whole freaking pipe of some sort. There we go. I got something coming. All the stuff we're finding is so solid, man. Oh, look at that. Oh, <laughs> so satisfying popping these little bubbles. Just this door to this safe weighs about 50 freaking pounds. It's just solid iron. Uh, off to the next spot. Uh, someone's definitely been magnet fishing here though. You see all the stuff on the bridge. That might be something already. Oh yeah, I got something on the very first throw. I think that is a piece of a microwave, maybe. Or maybe a piece of an electric motor of some sorts. There we go. Yeah, we got another like, elect oh my gosh, it just exploded in my hand. That's a weird connection right there. Oh, it's just broke, that's why. Some sort of motor. Here we go, got something coming. Yo, what is this thing? It looks like a kind of a piece of like a trailer hitch, maybe. Little receiver. Throw that in the bucket. Here we go, I got something coming. It's going in a circle. Oh, dude, it's a lunchbox. <laughs> is it a lunchbox thing or is it like a, like a candy lid? Yeah, look at that. There's like, it's like Christmas. That's pretty cool. What you guys think? Should we put this in the RV? It looks like a giant piece of rabar. Yeah, boy, we got a giant kebab. I got something, but I'm gonna go hit another spot. I don't know what that is. That thing is just weird looking. Dude, you know how disappointed I am? gonna be if i don't find anything here this spot looks so good finally we got something first find at this bridge piece of rebar all right we'll take it first find at this bridge is a piece of rebar oh man what do we got here i think we got two bike handles right here let's get the rest of it where is it i don't even know where i clicked onto that those have probably been down there so long the magnet just snapped onto and they just broke oh yeah we got something come on stay on stay on what do we got that is a very very weird shaped piece of rebar i think it almost looks like a ginormous steering wheel locker but i'm gonna go with rebar on that one there's just a big wood plank floating down the river well i felt a couple different clicks <laughs> Oh shoot, yo, there we go, we got a piece of a gun. That's what I'm talking about right there. There we go, look at that, man. We weren't finding like anything. I was just getting ready to go. And we got a little piece of a gun right there. All right, that's why you just gotta stay patient with it right there. If this doesn't show you how committed I am to this, I don't know what will, man. <laughs> I'm trying to get our 100,000 pounds rain or shine. First spot of the day right here. Doesn't look like anything too crazy, but there is another bridge. Whoa, I didn't even see that. There's a freaking seat. Someone was doing some sitting right here. It's just a foam seat. It must have fallen off like a lawnmower or something. Let's just get into it, man. Oh no, you can see how hard it's raining down there. It's coming. As long as there's no lightning, we're good. If a water drop leak gets in the mic port, I do apologize. Yeah, first throw of the day. Let's do this. Oh wow, this is actually way deeper than I thought it was gonna be right here. We're gonna try the other side. The only thing we got here, I felt two decent clicks, but they're just so far in the mud and covered in sticks, I can't get them. The only thing I got were these two little crusty flakes. Finally, I got something coming up. All right, we got a big piece of rebar. Oh, I felt so many clicks that I could not get up. Got a piece of rebar though, we'll take it. That's a thick rebar too, that stuff's heavy. Well, at least we got something. I'm gonna go wander the, that bridge over there and we're gonna try that one. This definitely looks like a better river right here. Let's just hope there's not as many sticks as the last one. Oh, look at that. There's a sign just chilling there, right there. He's hiding. Here we go, we got something coming. Oh, we got a pair of catfish skinners right here. Got a pair of catfish spinners, it makes sense spinners skinners makes sense there's a lot of a lot of fishing line up on the power line so probably a lot of people do fishing around here there is something come on stay on stay on oh yeah we got ourselves a little rim it looks like uh, first big find of the day a tire rim that is oh my gosh that's been down there for forever holy cow look at this <laughs> I could poke my finger right through it. That has been down there forever, man. All right, we'll set that. Oh my gosh. It's falling apart in my hands. It can't even support its own weight. Here we go, what do we got here? It looks like some sort of auger drill. Yeah, we got some sort of auger. Cool, I still don't think that was the big thing that I clicked onto, but that's pretty old right there. Put that in the pile, that's a cool find though. Let's see if there's any more. Any more stuff, I'm pretty sure there is. There we go, I definitely got something here. Oh no, but I also got the stick. Oh, I got another auger. Come here, it's going crazy. 
All right, we're two for two with these auger things. All right, there we go. This one's a little bit bigger. You know what? They might be paint mixers. They're either an auger or like a paint mixer. Actually, I don't know if the paint mixers are like that. Well, there we go again in the same spot. I got something coming. What do we got? It's another one. It's another auger, man. All right, at least I think they are. I could be completely wrong by saying that. But that is my best guess. They're all bent like crazy. Let's keep it going, man. Can we get another one? There we go. We got, oh, this is heavier. Oh, we got two on one throw. Two augers on one freaking throw. It's just like the break spot from the other day. Jeez, how many of them are down there? These are four and five right here. Oh no, are y'all okay? I just whacked it with the magnet. I'm sorry guys. Something right there too. Is there just a massive pile of these things out there? Let's move on down away from the auger spot. I'm not feeling anymore. Here we go, we got something. What is this? All right, come here, baby. It is a, looks like an old, it could be a piece of a car. I don't know exactly, that thing's pretty cool though. Oh yeah, I do, what is this? Oh yeah, it's a piece of a toolbox, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that's a piece of a toolbox right there. The handle broke though. You just hold it like that. Where are all the tools at, man? Where are all the tools at? Oh, we got a big old, uh, I was gonna say nail, but I don't think this is a nail. I don't know, it's a little piece of metal. We also have a Smirnoff twist off cap. Oh, look at that, some oil just popped up there. I like that. That's good stuff. We need to get that out of the water, whatever it is. Whatever it is. I'm going to pull up this sign and then I'm gonna head to the other side. We did pretty good right here, but I'm gonna take one more throw and see if I can pull up another auger. Is there any augers left? No! Oh, that was such a rookie move right there. Oh my gosh. Dang it, I just knocked the toolbox and that other piece back in the water. Don't leave your finds up there. That is rookie mistake. Oh my gosh. Oh, well we still got it. It's a big bolt. There's a massive log under there just chilling. All right, let's get this sucker up. Oh, there we go. Yep, just as I thought, easy. It's probably the easiest sign I've ever gotten up in my entire life. All right. Oh man, it's falling. There we go. Oh, there's a bee going crazy right there. Hopefully there wasn't a bee's nest on there. Oh, there's a big spider. Get away, get away spider. Oh my gosh, man, there's so much going on. There's spiders, there's bees. All right, we got it. We got it, man. <laughs> You can see how far in the clay it was. Look at that. It's about eight inches in the clay. Had to pull it out. Let's throw this big old boy over here in our pile. Making it bigger. Ow. That was very loud. Oh, I got a little something here. What is it? Oh, I don't even know. Little bubble wand. <sighs> I don't see no bubbles. We just got another little bubble dipper. Dual bubble dipper. All right, cool. We're switching spots. We're gonna go hit up a new bridge right now. We did do pretty good here. We got the rim and those little augers and a sign. I'll take that any day. It really started raining now. Oh my gosh, bro. Look at that. Dude, there's a gator right there. Look at that. Oh my gosh, he just came out of nowhere, bro. He was under the bridge. First part of the day is a freaking alligator. Ah, let's see. Yep, he don't care. <laughs> he probably thinks the magnet's food. Well, let's get started. Let's see if we're gonna find anything here. All right, I actually might have something on that there. Oh yeah, we got a bunch of nails. Oh my goodness. We got a piece of an old fishing reel too. I don't even, that's not even magnetic. Oh, it's just, Barely magnetic, look at that. And a bunch of nails. We went from not even finding one nail to just all of them. Here we go, feels a little bit heavier. Oh yeah, just more nails. Here we go, we got something right here. What do we got? Oh, is this an ax? Let's go, baby, we got a piece of an ax. That is so cool. All right, we got two fishing lures as well on that throw. Oh man, that is a super, super old ax head. <laughs> Ow! Ow! I just got hooked in my hand by a rusty hook. That did not feel very good. Let's keep it going here. That was the first throw over here. We got an ax head. I haven't found an ax head in a really long time. Oh, back to back finds. We got a little, I was gonna say that's a piece of rebar, but I don't think that's a piece of rebar. I don't know. All right, well, we'll throw it. No, no, 
Oh my goodness. Oh man. Oh no, I do have it. I do have it. All right. The find is saved. I found the same find twice. I don't know if that's ever happened before to anyone. <laughs> Also, if you guys are interested in getting into magnet fishing, go check out battlemagnets.us. The link is down in the description if you guys want to go find some cool stuff of your own. Oh my gosh, I got my first find! What do we got? Oh, what is it? It's coming up. I still cannot tell what it is. Oh man, it's heavy when it's up this high. Oh, we got two things. I don't know, a piece of the bridge and another piece of the bridge. Throw over that way. We got two things on that find. Maybe everything's over here. Uh-oh. Just as I suspected. Magnet fishing trash. Got something coming. Oh, just some rebar. All right, we just got a little bit of rebar on this thing. Oh, it's coming up. Oh man, that's a good shoulder workout right here. Just a little piece of rebar. Get over there. I'll throw this one over here too. Remember guys, if you go on magnet fishing, clean up your trash, man. A couple things, at least we didn't get completely blown out at this spot. These spots are surrounded by prisons that we are by right now. So we're gonna be magnet fishing next to a prison today. Look at that, look at all that barbed wire, man. Jeez, all right, well, let's see what we can find magnet fishing next to the prisons. Well, my other camera's acting up this morning. We got a full scrap trailer. We are on our way to the scrap yard. You guys know what time it is. Take a guess down in the comments on how much weight you think we got today. I'm gonna go with 1340 is gonna be my guess on how much weight we got today. All right, let's head to the scrap yard and see how much we got. They got a crazy operation going here though. Dang, man. They are rolling in the big guns, man. Need that for magnet fishing. That one alone has saved me a lot of time. A lot of it, the majority of it is out, so that is good. I will be happy with the majority. That helped a lot. <laughs> we still got a lot to pull out. Okay, we got it. Woo. Man, that sucked having to unload that by hand. All right, Thanks thank so you. Much. Have a good day. Yep, you too. 1340, I got it right. Oh my gosh. I got it right. I actually guessed the right amount. 1340, I'm like 80% sure that's actually what I said. And for 1340, we got $93.80. Low price of scrap, but whatever. We just made it to the first bridge of the day. Luckily, we're hitting it at low tide. It looks like a lot of people fish here just by the power lines, as you can see. It's like a Christmas tree. All right, well, we're gonna go to a new spot. This spot is no good. First throw of the day today. Whoa, that's not, I knew that felt weird. That's not a stick. It's some metal. I don't think it's magnetic. I just got under it. This is definitely magnetic, whatever I'm messing with right here. And there's a little bit of oil. It doesn't want to budge. There's a little bit of oil coming up though. I thought for sure that was a stick. Oh, there it is. See, I got it. I don't think it's magnetic even. No, it's just barely magnetic. All right, come here. I don't know what this is. It's just barely magnetic though. It's super, super light. Like. I just got it by that part. I have no idea what that is. Oh, there we go. We got something coming. What do we got here? All right, it looks like kind of a piece of a, like a small bucket maybe, like a piece of a bucket and just some little scrap crusties right there. We're able to park the trailer right on the bridge today so I can just throw all my trash straight into the trailer. All right, let's see if we got something here. Oh yeah, I knew it felt just a little bit heavier. Oh, it's nothing interesting though. Just a bunch of crusty cornflakes. Oh, there we go. We actually got a bullet casing on that throw too. I take it back. I take it back. Is today the day we finally find the AR-15 that I've always wanted to find? Oh man, there's even kicking up more oil right there. Yeah, we got a little something here. It's blue. It is a top of a like can, I think. Like a, like a pan lid. I, I don't know. <laughs> There we go. We got a little blue pan lid and a piece of a chain link fence. Oh, come on. Stay on. There we go. Yep, we got something all the way out there. What is it? Oh, it's a signpost, but there's like a log on it. No, it came off. It was like a post, like a wooden post with the sign on it. There we go. I got the sign. That wood post is going to be really freaking heavy, though. Ah, I don't think I'm going to be able to get that. That wooden post is just going to be so heavy. It's all waterlogged. Dang it! Oh my gosh. Well, that was the biggest find of the day. Something's coming. Whoa, it's a tire, but how is that magnetic? 
That doesn't make any sense. Now that's a big click right there. And it's coming. Come on, baby. Stay on. Oh man, this thing's freaking heavy. Oh my gosh, this thing's really heavy. What do we got here? Oh, I don't know what it is. Oh my gosh. Woo, that must be a piece of the bridge or something. I don't know what that is, but it is very, very heavy. Oh my goodness. And it's very magnetic too. Oh my gosh. I'm not even joking. This thing weighs at least 30 pounds. At least. Oh my God. Jeez, I'm gonna break the trailer just throwing it in there. All right, come on. We got something loose. What do we got? It looks like a drive shaft. Yeah, man. We got a freaking drive shaft. <laughs> Dang, that thing was so far in the mud. That thing's pretty freaking heavy too. Two big things on that one little area right there. Bam, there we go. There we go, we got something right here. Oh, dude, we got a fishing reel. Ow, I just got poked by something. Oh, it's a fishing hook. There we go, man. We got its initial DW. We got a little fishing reel. It definitely, I don't think it's gonna work anymore. It needs a little bit of love. We also got a little Bud Light cap and a little fishing jig. I don't know what this is. Oh! It's a sign post. All right, come here. We got a real sign this time, not a wood one. There we go. All right, it let loose. We got our first sign of the day. All right, I've magnet fished in this area before and I found a ton of signs last time. So I have a feeling we're gonna get a couple more. This one actually, like the yellow part looks pretty fresh. Look how yellow that is. Jeez, the post looks horrible, but. <laughs> That's a pretty fresh yellow striper right there. Oh, there we go. We got a little can lid on that throw. I might bring my bucket over here if I keep finding little stuff like this so then I don't have to keep running back and forth to the trailer. Here we go, we got a, what is this? I don't know, it looks like a support to something though from that bracket right there. Yeah, I have no idea what this is. It's some sort of little either support or, I made it, let's go. Supporter barrel or I don't know. Something weird. There is something down there, but it does not want to move. It is so far in the mud. Oh, there we go. We got a piece of a speaker, maybe? Yeah, there we go. We got a little piece of a speaker right there. At least I think it's a piece of a speaker. It could be a top to like a pan lid again, but I'm gonna go with speaker on that one. And I'm also gonna go to the next spot. I literally see it right there. It's like a hundred yards away, maybe not even. So. We're gonna head over there now and try luck at one bridge up. Look at that, that's sad though, man. Like I, I see at least a dozen tires right there. I don't know why people are like that. This doesn't look like how I remember it. Granted, it's been a year, but it doesn't look like how I remember. I definitely don't remember seeing those tires there. That's, that's very disappointing. We're gonna give this a go. We're gonna try it here. Well, we're just gonna go on to the next spot. We didn't really get anything here. This is all we got. Well, I see the first little baby gator, little baby alligator. This river looks like it's moving pretty quick. About 80% sure that it's tidal. So it looks like we're at the worst time we could possibly be magnifying here, but we're gonna go for it. All right, let's see if we got something. It feels a little bit heavier, unless it's just the current taking it. No, we got something on the very first throw here. What do we got? A mystery pipe. All right, there we go. We got a little mystery pipe right there. Oh yeah, we got, I think I got a boat plug right here. No, it's a it's a piece of scissors. That uh, definitely looks like it needs a little bit of work done to it to get it working again. Uh, let's see, it feels just a little bit heavier here. Just a little piece of rebar, it looks like. It's pretty light though, I don't know. It might have been some sort of pipe. Oh, I got a spark plug. <laughs> there we go, that's an old one right there. Who knows how long that's been down there for. Yeah, we got a little something here. It looks like a railroad spike, actually. Yeah, it is a really, really old railroad spike. It looks like it used to be silver. Wait, no, that can't be a railroad spike. Brake bike, maybe? I don't know what that is. Let's go, making all my buckets today. And that is gonna wrap up today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching all the way to the end. If you guys have made it all the way to the end of the video, comment safe down in the comments. We are gonna continue on looking for spots. It has been getting a little bit tough, but we are going to go on until we find a new area. All right, y'all, I appreciate y'all watching. I will see y'all later. Peace.